What is up YouTube, it's Vintage Poke Dad here. Uh, today we're gonna be opening up 12 booster packs, which is uh, part two of the Unbroken Bonds booster box that I uh, opened up a couple days ago. Uh, but before I do, uh, I did want to let you guys know that the giveaway is still going on to celebrate my 200 followers on uh, Instagram. So anyways, uh, to get one entry, uh, go over to my Instagram, uh, like the uh, entry post as well as tag two friends and make sure you uh, follow. That will get you one entry. And the second way to get an entry is on this YouTube channel. Uh, go ahead and make sure you're subscribed, like a video, and also uh, leave me a comment of your favorite Pokemon. That'll give you an uh, opportunity to get two entries. So uh, I will be drawing the winner uh, Sunday night. Um, so whether I do it through random.org or maybe have my daughter uh, select uh, the winners from a hat. So for now, uh, out. the prize of that giveaway is going to be four four Unbroken Bonds uh, packs, one of each uh, pack art. Uh, it's not going to be these uh, ones right here because we are opening up these 12 right here, but on the video, I believe a couple days ago, I did pull out four freshly up pulled boxes or pulled packs from the uh, box. So those are going to be the ones that I'm going to be mailing out to the lucky winner. But for now, you guys, let's see if we can get some magic out of these packs right here. I've got my trusty scissors here and I want to let you guys know real quick I'm actually waiting for a raffle to be drawn so if I do end up getting that notification I may show uh, I may show that on my phone we'll see. Anyways here is the code card and can we focus? Carvana, Togepi, Esper, Squirtle, Rhyhorn, Rhyperior, Quagsire. Oh, you know, I totally forgot to do the uh, the card trick. So out of it. Um, yeah, you guys, I'm pretty excited about the giveaway. It's my first giveaway. Uh, from what some of my fellow IGers have been saying is some of the giveaways can be kind of intense with all the uh, feedback and all the entries you get and so far it's been manageable but I guess we'll see what happens as it gets closer to the day. Alright, Chip Chip Axe, Tyrogue. I'm getting closer to finishing up this master set you guys and I really hope we get something really good out of these 12 because the last 12 Started off slow, but uh, picked up a little bit at the end there. Um, you'll probably notice my voice from this uh, video is different than the last two videos because I didn't have to worry about not waking anybody up. If you do see this particular setup here with my uh, mouse pad and everything and my voice is like this, that's because we are filming at like 11, 12 p.m. or a.m. technically. Um, while the family is sleeping. Did I do the magic? Okay, there we go. Focus. Thank you. Uh, Ghastly, Tangla, Venonat, Ratata, or Ratata, whatever. Growlithe, and Victory Bell. How are you guys doing today or during this uh, recording of this video? Today was a crazy day. We uh, took my daughter over to Disneyland for the first time and that was a lot of fun. She got excited seeing all the characters, but uh, kind of like everyone else that goes to Disneyland, they probably do not enjoy the uh, standing in line. And that's what we got to deal with most of the day today. And, oh, Green's Exploration. That may be a missing card in my deck, you guys. Uh, I think that will be uh, a nice addition. If not, you'll see it on my eBay. Sweet. Like it already. 
How have your guys' packs pulling been in this series, you guys? I heard I've seen some people get their uh, Reshiram Charizard and I honestly was considering just straight up buying it because I know I'm getting sick of chasing them, but I don't know. I think I mentioned in my last video that after that second booster box that I got, I think I'm actually done with this set and I'm gonna prepare myself for that 400, was it 400 plus cards, you guys? Of, ooh, back to back. Venomoth. Which is worth, I think, like two bucks, but, and I've got a couple of them, but, you know, whatever. I can't complain. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, I think I'm done with this set after the, the this last booster box, you guys, because I am going to prepare myself for that 400 plus card set of the Unified Minds. I did win a raffle on that one, uh, and I do have two of those boxes coming in from raffles, so it's a pretty good little jump start to that collection. I have noticed that these cards are readily more available now at my local um, card shops because I guess that next set of reprints of, has come out. So, but I don't know. Ever since I've been finding out about these razzes, razzes is that plural for razz? Um, and these raffles are kind of, kind of the way that I've been going with uh, trying to get booster boxes. And then when you luck out and score one for under uh, the price of a regular one, it's kind of cool. Except if you do end up getting into a losing streak, it kind of sucks. But uh, I have not gotten that losing streak yet, so. I'm rather fortunate. I think I've got a total of five booster boxes from these uh, raffles. Alright, I think I'm staring at five more packs after, er, including this one here. Focus, please. Thank you. Oh, I think we're about to go live on that raffle. If that goes live, I may share that with you guys. We'll see. Hopefully you guys don't find that too boring. Radicade. Lieutenant Surge Strategy. Samson Oak. Cottony. Ekans. Carvana. Litton. Clefairy. Rata. I have noticed some of my followers also on some of those raffles, so it's kind of cool because I've seen them win a couple of them. So it's always good kind of sharing that because it's just, you know, it's a, I don't know, for me, I find it kind of fun. You know, you're kind of gambling, but also uh, seeing some of your peers win. And you, you know, you can't be too selfish, right? Or can you? Can you? I'm good. Share the wins. Ooh, Celestila? Like it, I like it. Not bad. Not bad at all. I think two of those three though are gonna end up on my eBay. But lately I've been considering not selling on eBay anymore because you get hit with them fees and the extra bonus of selling on Troll and Toad has been kinda nice, so. I might be doing that from now on. Do you guys sell and troll or sell two troll and toad? Let me know in the comments, you guys. Kind of curious. Or do you guys just end up eBaying them or trading them off? I know trading was a big part of the game back in the days, but I'm not sure how often that's done nowadays. Maybe for the bigger ticket items. All right, two more packs, you guys. Got a messy stack of cards over here to my left, which you guys can kind of see already forming. Boop. All right. Energy. Torcat. Surprise box. Check. You know, I know I for sure still need this guy in a hollow. Or reverse hollow, whatever the case may be. I was just looking over my set the other day and I was like, I'm seriously missing that. Genesect. 
right. Ooh. Okay, give me one quick second, you guys. I am going to check my raffle. Here's a raffle for a base set booster box. Can we get lucky? Five more rounds to go. Come on. Vintage Poke Dead on top, you guys. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. Oh. Too much fun. Anyways, that's the stuff I've been doing lately. Energy, this is the last pack, you guys. Can we get some last pack magic going on here? And no, Mega. no luck, you guys. <sighs> All right, well, here is our recap for the day. I can't, can't complain too much because I think this greens exploration is actually something I need so. These two I think will be going on sale, and I think we got a winner for today. 12 packs, 12 more packs down, 12 more to go, actually not 12 more. Technically it'll be eight more, because those four that I pulled off to the side for one of you lucky guys will be going out sometime early next week after I choose the winner. Anyways, I uh, hope you guys all entered the giveaway, and I will talk to you guys next time.